Joanna Tofolian is in the middle of exams. She's studying at the Karodovila University of Medicine and Pharmacy in Romania. Before going to university, Joanna won a number of international prizes for young chemists. She says her knowledge of chemistry gives her an advantage over other medical students because she's better able to understand the effect of chemical substances on the human body. For example, Joanna and her research team recently discovered that a mixture of two specific chemicals can help contain and even destroy leukaemia cells. The chemical mixture is still being tested in the laboratory and it's uncertain if it will lead to a new medication. But the results of the young medical student's work have earned her the respect of her peers. She intends to continue her research even after becoming a physician. Cells are incredibly funny. They are like micro-humans that measure a couple of millimetres but uh, have their own autonomy and their own personality. And just like in human, they have to not always have to give the predictable responses. From the lab to the hospital. Joanna says it's important for research to yield practical results that benefit patients. Romania doesn't allocate much money for research or medical care, so she dreams of someday winning science's superlative award. If I would win the Nobel Prize, I would uh, spend some money in research and then the other half so to say, with the other half, I would build a hospital in Romania for, uh, with high-level technology for the people who cannot afford that. The young researcher is absolving the practical part of her education in a Bucharest hospital. It has a good reputation. Patients come from all over Romania to be treated by the country's top specialists here. Joanna's professor of cardiology has nothing but praise for her. She is very enthusiastic. She is uh, uh, very devoted to the patients. Even she likes a lot the research. I want to become a doctor because I believe that this is the career I can make most impact with. Uh, I think uh, it uh, suits very well to my beliefs and personality. Her current boss would love to have Joanna in her team, but that's not possible right now. The doctor-to-be still has a couple of months to go before she finishes her exams. Joanna Tofolian is one of four young Romanian scientists who have been invited to Lindau. She's determined to make the most of the honour and says she's hoping her five days in Germany will bring fresh inspiration, ideas and contacts. And Lindau could well provide a big boost to her career.